UHS Biology Past MCQs for MDCAT. Let's see tutorial 2. Welcome to PDMS Academy. We provide free online quality educational tutorials. In the name of Allah, who is the most beneficent and most merciful. The total inside capacity of lungs is, for the man, 6.7 liters, 7 liters, 2.5 liters, 5 liters. The correct answer is 5 liters. Good. The average lifespan of red blood cells is about 4 months, 2 months, 5 months, 1 month. The correct answer is 4 months. Very good. The lymphatic vessel of body empty the lymph into blood stream at abdominal vein, subclavian vein, jugular vein, bile duct. The correct answer is B. Subclavian vein. The right atrium is separated from the right ventricle by tricuspid wall, bicuspid wall semi-lunar wall septum the correct answer is tricuspid wall to memorize it bicuspid b for bicuspid and left ventricle also called bia valve so we remember it as tricuspid wall is present at the right side of the heart so the right atrium is separated from the right ventricle by tricuspid wall. The site of filtration in nephron is glomerulus and Bowman's capsule, proximal and distal end, ascending and descending or loop of Henle. The correct answer is glomerulus and Bowman's capsule. Good. Antidiuretic hormone increases the reabsorption of amino acids, salts, ammonia, water. The correct answer is water. Good. Because the antidiuretic hormone is the one that reduces uh, amount of urine production and it reabsorbs the amount of water to the body. Active uptake of in the ascending limb or thick loop of Henle is promoted by the action of aldosterone. The active uptake of which of the ion is promoted by the action of aldosterone? Uh, answer, answer is uh, D. Sodium, not potassium, chloride, or calcium. The correct answer is sodium. D. The process through which body maintains internal environment from the fluctuations of external environment is called as behavior of organisms adaptation thermoregulation homeostasis the correct answer is homeostasis good the active pumping out of sodium occurs at which part of nephron proximal tubule descending loop of Henle ascending loop of Henle collecting ducts active pumping out of sodium occur at the port of nephron which is ascending loop of Henle. The structures which respond when they are stimulated by impulse coming through motor neurons are receptors, responders, transducers, effectors. The correct answer is effectors because the effectors of the structure that respond to stimuli. Thalamus and cerebrum are the part of forebrain, midbrain, hindbrain, spinal cord. The correct answer is forebrain. Good. There is also evidence that high levels of uh, that ion may contribute to onset of LD Alzheimer's disease. Magnesium, molybdenum, aluminium, calcium. The correct answer is aluminium. Good. Aluminium, there is evidence that high levels of aluminium may contribute to onset of Alzheimer's disease. Aldopa or levodopa is used to get some relief 
Crohn, Epilepsy, Alzheimer's Disease, Parkinson's Disease, Dementia. The correct answer is Parkinson's Disease. Spermatogonia differentiate directly into primary spermatocytes, spermatozoa, secondary spermatocytes, spermatids. The correct answer is primary spermatocytes. This MCQ will be explained next. Traponema pallidum causes AIDS, genital herpes, syphilis, gonorrhea. The correct answer is syphilis. Syphilis is a disease that is caused by Traponema pallidum, which is a bacteria called spirochete bacteria. What is the location of intestinal cells? Sorry, what is the location of interstitial cells in the testes? Inside the seminiferous tubule, between the seminiferous tubule, among the germinal epithelial cells, around the testes. Interstitial cells are those cells that are present between the seminiferous tubule. So the interstitial cells are only the cells that are present between the seminiferous tubules and they help in production of testosterone hormone for the man. A type of cells in which human testes which produces testosterone are called germ cells, cellular cells, interstitial cells, spermatocytes. The correct answer is interstitial cells. Because interstitial cells that are present between the seminiferous tubules produce the hormone called testosterone. The hormone produced from carpus luteum is <coughs> prolactin, FSH, progesterone, LH. The correct answer is progesterone. Progesterone is the hormone that is produced from the carpus luteum. You have seen pictorial example. These are the cells that called Leydig cells. They are also called interstitial cells. They are present in interstitial space. And this area is of seminiferous tubules. And let's see, Sertoli cells are present between the seminiferous, uh, uh, in the seminiferous tubules. And they are helpful for the production of spermatozoa or sperm. So they are called as mother cells for the production of sperm. Let's see spermatogenesis. This is for spermatogonia or uh, 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 spermatogonia are called spermatogonia. They produce directly primary spermatocytes and these primary spermatocytes are then converted into secondary spermatocytes and secondary spermatocytes are converted into spermatids and then spermatids are converted finally into spermatozoa or sperm. The length of myofibril from one Z band to the next is described as sarcolemma, sarcoplasm, sarcomere, muscle fiber. The correct answer is sarcomere. Sarcomere is uh, uh, in the space that is present between two Z bands. Calcium ions released during muscle fiber contraction attach with myosin, actin, troponin, tropomyosin. The correct answer is troponin. Good. The joint that allows the movement in several directions is called hinge joint, ball and socket joint, cartilaginous joints, fibrous joint. The correct answer is ball and socket joint. Where can we find H zone in the figure of the fine structure of skeletal muscle myofibril? In the middle A band, in the I band, beside the Z line, along the I band. The correct answer is in the middle of A band. First vertebra of the cervical region of vertebral column is known as atlas. Sacral, thoracic, axis. Atlas is the first vertebra that is present in the cervical region, while the axis is second vertebra present in the cervical region. 
chemical insulin and glucagon are carbohydrates proteins lipids nucleic acids chemical insulins are proteins and glucagons are also hormones and are proteins hormones secreted by anterior pituitary and which control the secretion of hormones of other endocrine glands are known as release factor inhibitor accelerator trophic or tropic hormones the correct answer is d tropic or the trophic hormones are secreted from the anterior pituitary and control the secretion of hormones of other endocrine glands alpha cells of the eyelids of langerhans secrete which of the hormones glucocorticoids insulin glucagon aldosterone the correct answer is glucagon glucagon is a hormone that is produced by the alpha cells of pancreas while the insulin is a hormone that is produced by the beta cells of the pancreas so the glucagon relate to alpha cells AG. alpha cells secrete glucagon which of the following is the function of glucagon hormone glucose to lipid convert glucose to protein convert glucose to glycogen convert glycogen to glucose the correct answer is a glucagon hormone converts glycogen to glucose and increase glucose level in the body the correct answer is d in passive immunity which of the following components are injected into body antigens immunogens serum immunoglobulins in in passive immunity we inject immunoglobulins or antibodies in the patient or in the host which part of the antibody recognizes the antigen during immune response heavy part light part variable part consonant part which part of antibody recognizes antigen during immune response variable part is that part that we recognize we will explain it in the next two identical light chains and two identical heavy chains in antibody molecules are linked by disulfide bridges peptide bonds glycerol bond ionic bond the correct answer is a disulfide bridges antibodies are produced against invading cells by lymphocytes Basophils, basophils, and neutrophils. The correct answer is lymphocytes. Antibodies are produced basically by the B lymphocytes. There are two types of lymphocytes, T and B. Antibodies are produced by B lymphocytes. In the structural diagram of an antibody molecule, which portion is occupied by variable chains? Lower region. upper region middle region in between chains the correct answer is upper region upper region is a part of antibody molecule which uh, which is attached a uh, which is variable chain to which variable chain is attached or occupied let's see antibody this is heavy chain of antibody and uh, uh, the two chains that are attached with the antibody are called the light chains and these light chains as you are seeing it contain two part the upper part is variable while the lower part is consonant so this upper variable part is actually binding site for antigens so called as antigen binding site while the heavy chain only attach with each other by the bond called disulfide bond now 